So uh, we got approached just barely by a sales guy from the lightsabers and uh, he said that they had a cancellation and apparently the lightsaber uh, is booked out till March. I didn't realize that. I wasn't planning on getting one but now they uh, they convinced me so we're about to do the lightsaber thing. You have to reserve going and getting their lightsaber like three or four months in advance and we never did. And they had a last minute cancellation. So now we're gonna be able to go. And so I'm gonna have to sh figure out how to ship it home. Um, we'll have to go to the gift shop and figure out how to ship it. I traveled very far across distant lands, snuck past many first order outposts until I reached the cantina where Savi's workshop lay hidden. It was here that I met the gatherers and acquired myself for the first time a lightsaber, imbued by the power of the force. Here is my story. Growing up, I lived a life of turmoil, of trials, jumping from planet to planet. My parents, as survivors of the huge armada of Lord Malak, my parents died trying to save me by shuttling me onto a battle-ravaged planet of Taurus. There, I grew up on the streets, scrimping and saving, learning how to tinker with droids, learning to pilot buggies and transport ships, until when I became of age, I started to work for the now First Order. I had only heard rumors on Taurus, the once late Master Jedi Bastila, who set in motion an order called the Gatherers, who sought out Force-sensitive items. It was at this time that I started to realize something was different. I could make things move with my mind, and I could even hear voices. As I grew with age, so did my power, and with that I knew I must seek the one who was over this order of Gatherers. I met my wife, had children, and served under the First Order without fret. It wasn't until we made our way to the outpost at the Black Spire that I knew and heard of what was called the Resistance. Agents of the Resistance slowly converted me through propaganda and brochure. It is that then I realized that I needed to seek out the Savi workshop because I knew they would have the key for me to figure out where I belonged. And finally, for once in my life, be able to have some control over my destiny because I would not let any more evil Sith or First Order commander tell me what to do. As I made my way to the canteen, anxiety filled my mind and my thoughts. But with the help of my little one, I was able to make it through without problem and to meet the great Enmei, Lord over the Gatherers. And he welcomed me with open arms. Yeah. Right. And then go ahead and start heading down to number five, okay? Number five. Welcome, my friends. Bright Sands. How are you? Right on five, Good. my friend. And then put that red card at the top of your real station. Are you going to see you? Oh, you put it in. Excited? Yes. So are we. How are you two feeling? Good. Really excited. Very good. Very good. Rising moon. Yeah. Rising moon. 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 Everything all right? Yep. Good. So welcome, my friends, to Savi's workshop. Oh, we're just so glad you all found us. These are the gatherers that will be assisting you, and you may call me Envey. So please, take a quick look around. I know, I know what you're thinking, that all this looks like just a lot of old junk. But let me assure you of something. Some of it is new junk. <laughs> <laughs> we humbly call ourselves the Gatherers. Because we we search the galaxy for ancient relics in forgotten places, abandoned outposts, battle-ravaged planets. What we find, we bring here. 
So where a stormtrooper might just see worthless clutter, those who know see priceless history. For in these times, preserving our past may just ensure our future. Oh, I, um, I trust you've all heard the legends of Luke Skywalker. Yes, good. We hear there is another. A new Jedi. Do you know her name? Yes. Ray. Ray, indeed, my friend Ray. She was a scrapper just like us. But what Ray is now leaving, well, that is the spark of hope that we've been waiting for for so long. And that is why you are here to look ahead and to build a lightsaber. The lightsaber has been wielded by some of our greatest heroes and our darkest enemies. It is elegant, enigmatic. To build a lightsaber is an art. The saber then becomes a reflection of its builder with the force flowing between them. And today, you will feel that connection. So I think enough talk. Let's begin with perhaps the most important element of a lightsaber, the Kyber Crystal able to focus the energy of the Force to magnify it. Some say the Kyber Crystal is the heart of a lightsaber. The colour of the crystal determines the colour of the saber's blade. We've seen these with some of the greatest Jedi legends in history. The blue crystal, favoured by great Jedi Master Obi-Wan Kenobi, his apprentice Anakin Skywalker and Rey. Green. <laughs> Kwai Gong Jin, Ahsoka Tano, Master Yoda himself, and Luke Skywalker. Violet, a rare, beautiful crystal, favored by the great Jedi Master Mace Windu. And because there must be balance, red. Often called the Crystal of Power, favored by Darth Maul, Asajj Ventress, Darth Vader, and now Kylo Ren. But all these are stories of the past. We are here for you, our future. So it's now time for you to select your kind of crystal, the heart of your lightsaber. So builders, close your eyes. Good, open your eyes. And select your Kyber crystal. Okay, so let's carefully place those crystals into the green crystal holders in front of you. For it is now time to begin the construction of our gilts. So the gatherers will place before you the selection you previously made. And from there you will choose the precise components. Mm -hmm. I will comprise your unique lightsaber. The hilt is the foundation of the saber. This is your center of control. Also, it's the part that keeps your hands from being disintegrated. <laughs> so you'll see in the box the chassis. And on the other side, there's the activation plates. We'll select two of the four grips before affixing a blade emitter, then a pommel cap. Building a lightsaber is a personal journey. The gatherers are here to guide you through every part of the process. So, builders, let me ask you, are you ready? Yeah. Good. Then let's build. I have a crystal's break. I don't. I don't. Next, go ahead and choose one set of activation plates to go around your crystal. Okay, right. It's a dangerous challenge, and I have to defend yourself. Okay, come close. So if you try to get it to the line, um, you're supposed to go to the scatter. Alright, so now go ahead and choose any two of these four grips. One for the top, one for the bottom. You'll see one set has that thicker silver ring. That side is going to go in towards the activation plate. 
All you need to do is push down and twist until you feel it tighten into place. Oh, this is hefty. Can I feel it? Sure. How does it feel? Uh, that one was that one. Yeah, there it is. Love it. Saber picks the, the force wheel. Your looks like Obi-Wan. Yeah. Instead of um, this one. This one looks cool. Which one am I taking? This one. That one is that. Whoa! I like the. Uh, we used to have a this, this reminds me of a, a samurai. It's now a one arm. Thunder breathing. First form. Oh, what a beautiful Jedi Saber, my like friends. What color crystal did you select for yours? Blue. Yes. Outstanding. Yep. Now, my friends, I've got to be honest, this is coming up the most dangerous part of the process. Is that perfect? Excellent. If you could just display it in the, uh, the cradle there for us, because now's the time. If you could all take a step back, our gatherers will prepare your hits for their first activation. The trick is not to invert the emitter making so we get more holes in the seat. Well, now, my friends, I don't know. Wait, what's happening? With any punch, you begin English. With the heart of the saber they are joined, much more they will become. It's time. <laughs> Yes, it is indeed time. Time for the bond between Builder and Saber to be forged. So in just a moment, I'll ask the Builders to take a step forwards, place a hand on the hilt of their lightsaber, and then on my mark, we'll activate them together. Builders, are you ready? Yes! Then take a step forward, place a hand on the hilt of your lightsaber, and Activate. Ready? Oh. And raise your lightsabers. You have built a lightsaber. But the Jedi can sit before you. You could change the galaxy. Remember, it only takes a spark. Deactivate and lower the lightsaber. Complete your lightsaber is. Choose your path, it cannot, but like your way, it can. May the force be with you. Oh, thank you, Master Yoda. Builders, in your hands you now hold remarkable power. And remarkable power should not be dropped on the ground. <laughs> so to protect your savers, we're pleased to offer you a lay saber machine. In a moment, I'll dismiss you one group at a time. For our time is now at an end, but yours is just beginning. It's time to make your mark on the galaxy, for you are as unique and as extraordinary as the lightsabers you have created. And who knows, next time, we could be telling your stories. Raise your sabers and activate! Uh, Would well, you be the first to head back for the outcomes, my friends? And congratulations!
Hit like if you like, subscribe if you want to see more. Andy, any vlogs signing out?